good morning. So it is 6.30 in the morning and I got up a little bit ago to catch sunrise here in the Chiricahua National Monument. Uh, they have I, what I believe is their highest peak, the Sugarloaf Mountain. And I'm gonna go ahead and hike that up. It's a mile hike, and so it's not bad at all. And I think they said you ascend uh, almost 800 feet uh, to the top of this mountain and should be a really good sunrise. I woke up to temperatures about 35 degrees. Uh, so that wasn't fun to make coffee in. Um, and I had to stay on a road that had zero cell phone service and was very washboardy. So I'm just coming down that road now. But when I get to the top of the mountain or at least to the, to the bottom of the mountain and start hiking, I'll turn the camera back on. don't know if I'm gonna actually make the sunrise itself. I think I'm gonna miss it by a few minutes. All right, that right there, that hill, that's where I'm gonna climb this morning to try to catch sunrise. That is Sugarloaf Mountain. I'm gonna zoom in on the top. That right there on the very, very top is a ranger station. So it should be cool to get to the top and catch sunrise. Although I think I'm gonna miss a sunrise because it is like 7, 106 now. And uh, I think sunrise is about 7.17. And it usually takes me about 15 minutes roughly to do a mile. And that's what that length of that hill is. And I'm going uphill, so it's gonna be a little slower. So yeah, gonna miss sunrise. But still should be a very good hike. And there's only one other person here. So cool. Let's go ahead and start this little hike. Sugarloaf Mountain Trail. Oh, there we go round trip 1.8 all right let's go all right it is already proven to be a very very cool little hike here sun rises over those hills right there spectacular views from here get past these trees oh yeah I think the actual sunrise is going on right now. It's about 7.18, I think it just happened like a minute ago. But this trail kind of wraps around the, the mountain here, the hill. And uh, so I'm on the back side of it at the moment. You can see, man, really cool. Really, really cool views. up here so hopefully you can hear me I'll speak up a little bit snow capped mountains over there and the actual sunrise
saw on the top of the hill I was driving up. Coming around the back side here. So. Yeah, this is very cool up here. Cool as in cold. <laughs> oh, there's actually just a little bit more trail over here. Well, I just asked Siri what the temperature is, and she said it's 30 degrees, but it feels like 23. And of course, I'm sitting on top of a very windy mountain, so it's even colder. Uh, I have no idea what the temperature is. I was the camera shaking, it's so windy up here. But I think I'm gonna start hiking down. Let me grab the car and the trailer and head to Tucson, which, my next, which is my next destination. But I think I've accomplished my mission, which is to wake up at 5:30 in the morning. Try to put on pants in a very tiny teardrop trailer, make coffee in the pitch dark, drive down a very bumpy road for 30 minutes to climb 800 feet to reach the sunrise. Something you can do any day, any time. But I think in this case it was definitely worth it. It was an amazing sunrise. Even though I actually missed the actual sunrise coming up because I was hiking on the back side of the mountain, but it was still worth it. Alright guys, thanks for actually taking on the line with me.